Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how I pack for a weekend trip. So if you're interested in seeing that, please stay tuned. So I like to pack minimally when I am going just on a weekend trip. So I usually just bring my Longchamp bag. This is the size large and then another bag. And this time I'll be using my Uniqlo bag. So I want to first show you what I have in this Longchamp. Okay, let's take this out of the way. Okay, so again, this is the size large. I have it packed in here. So let's see. So here's what it looks like. And I'm just going to pull everything out and then put everything back in just so you see how the layout is, okay? All right, so in this back pocket here, I have a bag that is um, full of feminine products. And then I have my makeup case here. And in this I have, I have a lippy, another lippy here, eyeliner. This is the Kat Von D tattoo liner. And then I have this. This is the Jessica Alba's Honest Beauty Cheek and Lip Tint. So there's that. And then I have a perfume here. This was the Chanel number no. five, but I ran out. So I just refilled it with a different scent. And then I have some hair ties and bobby pins. And that all goes in here. I don't wear much makeup when I'm on vacation. So this is everything I'll bring. Let's put that back in. All right, and then I have my supplements in here. What else? Oh, that's just the Longchamp uh, little care booklet. So that's everything in this back pocket here. And then let's get to the front pocket. I just have some Clorox wipes. When I get onto the plane, I like to wipe my seat. Yes, I'm one of those people. <laughs> and I have some newborn wipes. This is made with sterilized water only. And these are great if you need to wipe your hands or if you need to bring one in the restroom with you. So that's all that's in this front pocket here. And now let's get into the main compartment. So first I have this case here. And this case is just for my contacts. So it has a mirror. And then I have um, extra pair of contacts, the container, and then some eye drops in here. Okay. And then I have on this side here, I have my toiletries. And here is everything. This is what it looks like. So let's just go through it. Of course, I have some lotion. I like this Cetaphil lotion. It's pretty clean ingredients, and I use it for uh, my hands, my body, and my face. And then I have my contact solution. And then I have some eye cream. This is the Biosense um, Night Cream or Night Serum. And then I have my Tatcha Serum as well. I use this at night. I like to layer on my products. And then I have the Naturium Face Wash. This is really good. I have normal to dry skin and this does not dry my skin out. It actually makes it feel really good. So there's that. And then I have my toothbrush and I have another body lotion. This is the Burt's Bees body lotion. And I have some hair ties and a comb that's broken, <laughs> but, but it still works. And then I have this Naturium Dew Glow SPF moisturizer 
when I use this, I look like I have that Korean glass skin, which is really nice. And I don't even need to use um, face makeup. So I love this stuff. And then I have, I put this stuff on my lips. This is the uh, Pacha Gold Spun Lip Balm. It's really moisturizing at night. So I use that. And then a few more things. I have some Neutrogena makeup wipe removers. I like to wash my face at night, but sometimes I just need the makeup remover for my eye makeup. So there's that. And then I have some floss in here and some Zycam. I learned about Zycam when I watched the What's in My Bag from Emma Watson. And she swears by this stuff. So if it's good enough for her, it's good enough for me. So I bring a few of these and let's see okay these here let's put this down i got these from my stay at the plaza so this is the shampoo this is the gel the shower gel and then this one is the conditioner and they smell so good so i always like to bring these i actually have quite a few i like to collect toiletries from hotels so i'll be bringing that and then see a few more things i have these little discs in here and when you add water it turns into a little towel so i have that and then i have my toothpaste and a gua sha just in case i want to gua sha my face so there's that okay let's put everything back a lot of the times i bring more than i need but I like to be prepared. So this is everything I bring as far as toiletries go. And let me see, toothbrush. And so I can, and then the hairbrush. And there you go. All right, now on to the other things that are in here. So let's just go on to this side here. I have some water wipes. Again, we can use this for when we're on the plane because usually I keep this bag underneath the seat. And then I will use this if I need to um, before we eat or even just to wipe things down. So there's that. And then I'm going to be bringing my belt. Okay, and then here I have my brassiere, my socks, and my chonies. But I'm not about to show you guys my chonies. Just believe that there are four pairs in here. And then I have four pairs of socks. So there's that. And then these are the clothes I'm bringing. So I have one pair of pajamas. And then I have three outfits here. So I have these pants and my shirt. And then I have a workout outfit. And then another outfit here, jeans, a cardigan, and then a black shirt. And that is everything let me just take this out show you guys so there you go all of that fit in here so let's put everything back in and then as far as shoes goes i'm only going to be wearing one pair of shoes the entire trip and i'll be wearing that obviously on the plane and then i'm also going to be wearing a jacket as well so a tip is to wear your bulkier items on the plane or train, whatever mode of transportation you guys are taking. So there's that. And then I'll put this right in front. I love these Longchamp bags because they're so spacious and the zipper is very sturdy. And let's put this on the side. 
So that's what it's looking like. And then this goes on the side. And I honestly don't even need to bring this belt, but I like to wear it with one of the outfits. But, yes. Do you guys like to pack minimally when you're going on a weekend trip? If you do, what kind of bag do you guys use? I always use this one. I used to use a backpack, but I just love how spacious this long shop is. Okay, so now that everything's back in here, the thing you need to do is make sure it will close this way so that way the zipper doesn't rip. So just like that. And there you go. So then I'm going to show you what I carry in my Uniqlo bag. Okay, so this is the viral Uniqlo bag. And this is what I will be bringing with me on this trip. I was debating on whether I should bring like one of my, either my Celine bag or my Chanel walk. But I just want to be casual. So I'm going to bring this. And this is what I have inside. Of course, I have it packed. And the first thing I have is my book that I'll be reading. This is um, Lessons from Madame Chic by Jennifer L. Scott. And then I have a snack bag here. And it just has my electrolytes drink, some Ricola, and then it has a bar and some... Let me show you. This is like one of my favorite. This oatmeal snack or oatmeal bites. It's really good. So all that's in there. And then some hot sauce. So I have that. And then I have a little notebook here. I like to jot things down sometimes when I'm on the plane. So I keep that in there. And then I have my EDC. This is a simplified one because a lot of the things that I have normally in it, like the Gerber or my scissors, I don't like to bring on the plane with me. So all I have in here are some Purell hand sanitizers. And then I have a nail file. And then I have this little towelette. And then I have a shout wipe and then a few band-aids here, different sizes. And oh, I have this little suture, butterfly suture band-aid just in case. And then some first aid ointments, alcohol prep pads, and some Tylenol. What else? And that is, oh, and then I'm bringing my nail cutter. So that is everything in there. I like to make sure I have a basic first aid kit with me. It has come in handy quite a few times, so I like to keep it stocked. And this is a very basic EDC that I'm going to be bringing. So there's that. And then I have my wallet. You guys are familiar with this. I have um, my cards in here. I have a couple credit cards and then my ID. And then I have a hand sanitizer. You guys know I love this stuff. It's very moisturizing and I like how slim it is. And apparently it kills 99.9% .9 of germs. So that's always good when you're traveling. Okay, okay, and just a few more things here. So I have my charger, of course. I have a Uno card game, and this is my family's favorite game to play, so I have a miniature one, and I bring this on all of my trips, so there's that. And just a few more items. I have a couple of pens here. This one has a light, just in case I need to check anyone's Perla. <laughs> and there you go and I have my airpods of course 
And then what, what else? There's two pockets in this bag. So it's just one main compartment and then two slip pockets in the front here. So I have tissues in this one and then some hand sanitizers, alcohol prep pads. I like to use this to clean my phone and then more wipes. So there's that. Oh, a few more things. Of course, I need some chapstick and then more Zycam. Okay, so let's put everything back in. This bag does not look big at all, but it is so spacious. It fits a lot of stuff and it went viral for a reason. I'm so in love with this bag. I use it a lot. Do you guys have this unique little bag? Because if you don't, I highly recommend getting this bag. It's good for every day and it actually looks quite chic. And it's such a lightweight bag. So, yes, let's see. So there you go. And let's just close it up. And there you go. So that's what it looks like. It is so cute. I love this bag. And it was only $19, oh, almost $20. $19.90, I believe. So yeah, that is what I will be bringing. So that is it, you guys. This is what I will be bringing on my trip. So I will put this bag underneath my seat like I always do. And then I will keep this next to me so I have easy access to everything that's in here. Oh, and last thing I wanted to show you guys is my phone. I will be keeping my phone on this lanyard here. It's so convenient to have this because I'll be wearing this crossbody and you can have your phone easily accessible and then you can be hands-free whenever you need to. So yeah, I got this from Amazon and I can link it down below for you guys. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, please like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!